The entertainment industry is rife with unions. I've already mentioned Actors' Equity, which is the stage union for actors and stage managers. But actors have many unions to which they can be members. There is SAG, which is the Screen Actors Guild, the union for film actors. AFTRA, which is the American Federation of Television and Radio Artists. This is the union for actors who are working on radio and television. There's AGMA, the American Guild of Musical Artists, which is the union for vocalists. And AGVA, the American Guild of Variety Artists, which is the union of magicians and jugglers and comedians, etc. AGVA was a very large and powerful union in the days of vaudeville and early television, but it has shrunk considerably in the latter parts of the 1900s. There's also the Screen Extras Guild. On some films and many TV shows, the extras are actually professionals. It is more important to have professional extras for TV because TV operates on such a tight schedule. A professional extra helps them keep on schedule because they don't need to be educated on what to do and they can be guaranteed to do what they're supposed to do. There is often a schism in the performing world or in the entertainment industry between talent and technicians. What I've mentioned so far are the talent unions. Now the backstage unions. IATSE, which is the International Alliance of Theater Stage Employees, and the Moving Pictures Machine Operators Unions are responsible for almost all technicians and technical work in film, TV, and theater. IATSE's is one of the most powerful unions in the country, and in New York City it is traditionally a union that you nearly have to be born into in order to get into it. Although in the last 20 or 25 years, IATSE Local Number 1, the very first chapter of the IATSE union, has opened its doors to new members who are not related to old members. There are other unions that cover people working in the creative side of the industries. For instance, the United Scenic Artists Union covers designers and painters. The Society of Stage Directors and Choreographers is a union for stage directors and choreographers working in theater. The Directors Guild of America is for directors of film and television. And the Dramatists Guild of the Authors League of America is a union which covers playwrights, lyricists, composers, and librettists. This list of unions involved in film, theater, and television is not exhaustive, but it gives you an idea of the type of union activity and therefore the types of people who are involved in bringing you mass entertainment.